I cannot give you financial advice, but I can tell you how I study projects and also what I'm excited about so that way you can make better decisions for yourself. When I first started investing in cryptos, it was about making a fast buck. Buy and drop. Buy low, sell high. I treated each currency as a cash cow and didn't care for anything except for return on investment. I didn't read anything or know much about some of the currencies I was investing in. Then as I began to study and learn more about the digital currency, I developed an appreciation for the technology. You should do the same. You'll eventually get burned in blind trading. You need to be investing in coins that have a strong core. Many of the cheap uninspired altcoins won't be around two years from now, and people will lose money. In fact, even some of the altcoins that have high contributions and a great development team might end up flopping due to high competition and influence of investor sentiment. My advice is to invest in coins that have a proven track record and are very likely to be around in the future with a slight mix of high-risk currency just for fun. There are many indicators to determine which coins have potential. The common method of choice would be to go with what everyone thinks will succeed and where everyone is dumping their money. You need to do your own research. Here are a few tips before you dive into the cryptocurrency world. Educate yourself. Learn the technology behind these cryptocurrencies. Understand the phenomena and do not be a victim of the greater fool theory. Secure your wallet. This cannot be emphasized more. The more the demand, the greater the risk of these online exchanges being compromised or overburdened. Hold for long. Lock in some profits for your satisfaction by day trading, but it would be a better deal to reap its benefit after a few years. I made my first investment at a certain price x. Today it has jumped to 10x. The technology radically changes all the time, and the crypto space exists on the bleeding edge. So as always, I am just a guy on the internet, and this is not investment advice. I am just going to point out a few cryptos I think have a long-term future, say why I feel so and leave the rest up to you. Welcome to the Atlantis Report. Bitcoin, Bitcoin, Bitcoin. Why Bitcoin? Bitcoin has been around for more than 10 years and has a large community with a big pool of developers. I think it is here to stay in one way or another. The herd is coming, Bitcoin has already gained a lot of attention. The greater fool theory has started to show its effect. Coinbase, the US largest Bitcoin exchange, has seen a surge in the number of users. 100,000 buyers in three days. Remember, the current price of $7,300 would seem to you of the same small magnitude as many people today see the year ago price of $1,000. The Silicon Valley is upbeat. Listen to John McAfee, Bill Gates, Richard Branson, etc. It is a store of value. Digital gold if you like. Here are the facts about Bitcoin. Limited supply of 21 million equals extremely high price when cryptocurrency is adopted by the masses. There is a good chance that Bitcoin will be trending at $1 million plus in the next decade or so, and the world's population will be buying groceries with Satoshi's 0.0000001 Bitcoin. There is also a good chance that the vast majority of the world's population will never own a full Bitcoin, due to its future price. Bitcoin is being coded by the best developers in the world. If one of the smartest groups of people in the world believe in this concept, why shouldn't you? BTC is the first cryptocurrency ever created, which produced so much momentum that it would be implausible for the coin to die anytime soon. Despite the recent hard fork, the price has actually gone up, which indicates strong backing by the investors, speculators, and the crypto community in general. Bitcoin attracts more people that feel they need to share their views on the scaling issues than any other coin. This only cements Bitcoin's popularity and positions it for future exponential growth. BTC has not even come close to peaking, which is the number one reason for the green light to invest in this asset. Bitcoin will reach its peak when it becomes the world's currency, which could happen in the next couple of decades. Bitcoin is already solving real-life problems when it comes to our flawed monetary system. People have gone from the commodity money paying with physical gold and silver to political money fiat and it's about freaking time we go to digital money. We have moved on into the information age, upgraded pretty much everything else in terms of the technology we use electric cars, mobile phones, internet, solar energy, etc. But we still use money the same way we used it 50 years ago. 
And let me tell you, not taking action about this is taking bold action in the wrong direction. Just three simple examples of the monetary problems, and believe me, I could go on with these until you stopped watching. 1. Who wants to own, in their right mind, a $20,000 credit card and trust the provider to keep their personal information safe? And if they don't do that, you will spend another three months going back and forth trying to wipe your fraudulent profile because somebody had used your card to buy an iPad. You wouldn't have had this problem on the Bitcoin blockchain now, would you? 2. In more than 20 countries, the retirement funds have been nationalized. This means that these governments used up perhaps your money to fund the mistakes made by incompetent political decision makers. They didn't ask anyone's permission to do that. They just did it, whether you like it or not. Now, would that be possible on the blockchain? Of course not. Well, you know where I'm going with this. These are just a few reasons why it's worth taking a look at investing in Bitcoin and the concept behind it. It's just simply a ton better than what we've been using since the World War II. Before investing in a cryptocurrency, we always make up our minds if we want to invest in the long term or short term. And on the basis of the planned duration, we tend to make our choices. Not every cryptocurrency is ideal for a long term or a short term investment. As per the current market trends, these are some of the cryptocurrencies which will be worth investing in. Again, you have to make your choice on the basis of your expectations and suitability. Bitcoin is the path-breaking cryptocurrency as it is the first one in the league and has paved the path for the other cryptocurrencies since its invention. Currently, more than 17.2 million Bitcoins are in circulation out of 21 million, which has been predetermined as the limit. Its price skyrocketed towards the end of 2017, and since then, it has faced a lot of turbulence. Therefore, Bitcoin's detractors are worried about its incredible volatility and transaction fee. According to CoinMarketCap data, the current market cap of Bitcoin is $207,968,803,193. Despite the cons that keep Bitcoin in the headlines, it is the most popular cryptocurrency and has been ruling since its invention. Ethereum The first smart contract platform it has launched a lot of dApps and has a talented team working on it. There is a lot of dedicated people who want it to succeed. Ethereum is a fast-picking technology based on blockchain, which provides better solutions like smart contracts, ICOs, etc. Many large financial and tech firms have already backed the Ethereum-based blockchain. The team behind Ethereum blockchain development are a bunch of smart guys who are devoted to the task of providing a better and far more useful technology in the decentralized domain. A few dApps decentralized applications have already been deployed and are providing a totally new dimension to the world of forecasting and business contract executions. It is a deployable futuristic technological service. Ethereum, thus, has definitely gained the first mover's advantage in the blockchain world. When I started investing in Ether, it was trading at a mere $100. It has shown some quick gains by catching the blockchain enthusiasts' attention. Ether is a good long-term hold. Ethereum is the second most popular cryptocurrency, also touted as the main rival of Bitcoin. It came into being as the world computer network for the development of apps through decentralization. The co-founder of Ethereum claims that it is a more programmable currency than Bitcoin while establishing the fact that Bitcoin has laid the foundation for blockchain technology. The circulating supply of Ethereum is 101,522,083, and the market cap is 28,138,922,255 dollars USD. EOS. The great competitor to Ethereum. It's faster and is already proof of stake with a sidechain system almost ready to go. Is there room for both EOS and Ethereum? We shall see. DV. It's a small market cap coin with a lot of potentials. It has an easy to use master node system and is dedicated to making crypto easy to use and easy to switch coins with. It's still new, but it has a wonderful team. DV is cryptocurrency made easy. Masternodes deployed in one click. Silica Nays Us. This project is a video game that meets the crypto project that is going to be big. Imagine if every person who went to the video game arcade had crypto. Silica Nays Us will make this happen. Litecoin focuses on delivering a cross-border payment platform that is viable in surmounting the substantial current barriers. 
The total number of Litecoin available for mining is 84 million. Litecoin facilitates faster transactions as compared to Bitcoins. Therefore, it offers greater transactability and scalability. Ripple emerged suddenly during the end of 2017 and soared exponentially to surpass Ethereum in a way that it has secured the third position in the cryptocurrency ranking list. Ripple is a centralized transaction network and serves an entirely different purpose as compared to Bitcoin. The maximum supply of Ripple is 100 billion, and the circulating supply is 39,524,508,956. It has a market cap of 12,870,751,853 dollars USD. Besides the above four cryptocurrencies, there are a few more cryptocurrencies that are performing quite well, such as Zcash, Dash, Neo, Cardano, and Monero, among others. You might as well consider investing in these according to your requirements. This was the Atlantis Report. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.